Well hello and welcome to another video from the Computer Techie and today we'll be doing um, or setting up a FTP server specifically on the Raspberry Pi within the Raspberry Linux distribution this would also work in um, Ubuntu as well um, we're going to be using Pro FTPD server um, it's very easy to set up and install but if you're running a website or something off there or if you're Raspberry Pi and you want to upload files to it or even just upload files to your Raspberry Pi FTP is a, a good way to do it so as you can see in a second I will just have um, a normal web server on here it just comes to it works and we'll upload a new web page to the Raspberry Pi server using FTP so the first thing to do is do um, an update command and make sure that you've got all your latest packages so just like that this will do do something or is it just going to sit there there we go okay right it's done its thing and then we want to do the sudo apt get install pro ftpd and that will install the ftp client for us or server even press Y and then we're going to go with standalone so just press enter right that's done and then we need to configure the FTP server so you will want to run this command here sudo nano etc uh, pro ftpd pro ftpd config and so this is the config for the FTP server so here we can give it a name a server type a welcome um, give it welcome messages things like that and we can jail users to specific folders um, it's set on port 21 so we can set it on any port there if we like and also set passive ports so that's useful if you're doing it out to the internet and um, this you'd set if you were doing it out to the internet over um, network address translation so when you're opening ports um, you want to fiddle with that um, most of these settings you want to set if you're sticking stick in your FTP server out on the internet but for now we should just be using our um, normal uh, login for the Raspberry Pi which is Pi and Raspberry I think something like that so whatever your normal login is it will use um, you can set up your own FTP users as well um, just as normal units users Everything's looking okay at the moment. I haven't seen anything that I need to change um, right now. And um, we can set an, an anonymous FTP user. Um, there's nothing really that we need to change right now, just as we're doing this locally. And then the next thing to do is just to restart the Pro FTP service. like that and then you want to grab your FTP client I um, prefer FileZilla so I'm just going to open that up now ok 
Okay, so here is FileZilla, and we just stick in the host. The username, which would be pi, and the password. password that was it so there we go so now we are connected to the server over FTP and these are all the files um, and folders that you'd see if you was running looking the folders up in uh, Linux because if we just did over here um, DIR like that you'd see what we're in So now that's the um, base directory. You can see there's all the folders in the base directory. And if we come over to here, again, that bin, boot, dev, same as here. So it's exactly like browsing um, within the Raspberry Pi, but through FTP. So to upload a file, to your web server in this case, you need to go to var www and then there it is. There's our index.html. So I need to grab a, a file somewhere that I can like, upload. Um, see if I can find one. Okay, so I've uh, found an old website. Um, in theory, this is either going to work or it isn't. I might have to add permissions. Yeah, permission denied. Okay, so we won't be able to write or overwrite to files. So we need to come over to here and we need to come into the folder that we want to write to. So do a cd slash var slash w. And then we want to do, uh, what was it? It was uh, sudo cho um, the username, which would be pi, and then the directory. Like that. And now, hopefully, we should be able to change in here. Yep, there we go. So now we can delete, add, and whatever you to this folder for that specific user. So I have an old, um, old website here that I made years and years and years ago. And then if we go over to the website. Yeah. There we go. So <laughs> that is that's how you change and upload the files to your Raspberry Pi using FTP. Um, if you have any questions, then uh, leave them below. Um, I hope this helped you out somewhat. I no, I didn't go into too much detail on adding it to setting up your config to add it to the internet although um, there are those comments in that config file is fairly self-explanatory although I'm happy to help anyone who doesn't exactly understand um, what you need to do um, I have been adding the 
commands to um, well this isn't finished yet but to like my own personal uh, I suppose blog I suppose you could call it but if you just come over to this domain here um, I've added the short commands of here of what to do so you can just select copy come over to your um, window and then paste them in and then it will be slightly quicker than typing them so they're already here um, including your setup the PHP my admin Ubuntu thing there as well if you need it um, so yeah I hope you enjoyed this video give it a thumbs up if it helps out if you have any questions leave them below I'll see you guys in the next video